Welcome to Code Rush Feature of the Week. What have we got this week, Mark? This week, I'm going to show you E for Enum. So, so Roy, you know my awesome Shape Painter application. I do. I it The last time we saw it, it could only draw rectangles, but now I want it to draw ellipses. Okay. And, and so I've got the ability, when we go in and create something, to create a rectangle or a uh, shape based on uh, this call over here to create. Uh, it takes an active shape. Uh -huh. The active shape is over here declared. I haven't actually built it yet, It's but I've got it. You can see it's called shapes. Yep. So what I want to do is over here in my shapes files, I want to create and declare that enum. So I'm going to use the letter E to do it. And E is uh, one of the, the templates that you can create that you can use to create code in Code Rush. You just hit the letter E, follow that with the space bar or the tab key to expand the template, and you you okay. get the, the, uh, the structure of the enum is there. Sure. I can call this shapes, hit enter, and now my first element, I can call this rectangle, like this, and hit enter. Notice I don't have a comma yet at the end. No. When I hit enter, it adds the comma automatically. Very good. And I'll call this ellipse, and I can continue to hit enter. Maybe uh, create a shape called star. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe another one called rounded rect. And what I'm doing, what's cool is I'm just pressing enter each time. I don't have to hit the comma. It automatically is adding the new element for me each time, all the way down. Um, and uh, let's do a last final shape called arrow. So these are the different shapes that I would be able to draw. Yep. And now when I'm finally done, I just hit the semicolon. That's the smart semicolon feature, and it gets sure. me out. Which, of course, in C Sharp is essentially I'm done with this this active thing, usually a statement, but in this case, uh, just as valid. Exactly, and that's it. And it's very simple, just the letter E, and, uh, and then you're hitting Enter between all the pieces. Now nice. I can come in here and draw the uh, ellipses. I'm thinking about entering this, putting this in my personal gallery. Absolutely, some classic modern art in the making. Yeah, I'm going to have a gallery called uh, Five Ellipses, and I'm just going to have a bunch of these in there, and they're going to think I'm the best painter in the world. So um, <laughs> so that's it. That's E for Enum. It's pretty quick and easy. One thing I want to show you on this is if you go into the Code Rush setup wizard. Uh -huh. Oops, sorry, it's on another screen. Here it is right over here. I'll bring it in here. I'll show it to you. Uh, I want to show you the uh, pieces that are relevant to this. Um, smart semicolon is one of the pieces. So you want to have enable smart semicolon yep. um, active. That's one of the pieces. And uh, the second piece is code template expansion. So sure, you need yeah. to have one of these last two options selected, either tab key or spacebar. And that's it. Fair enough. Well, thank you very much, Mark. We'll see you next week for another feature of the week. For more Feature of the Week videos, click one of the two video links on screen or select from our playlist. Download and learn more about Code Rush from the DevExpress website. And be sure to subscribe to our channel to receive all the latest Code Rush feature videos. Thanks for watching. See you next time.